Hello, I am Dr. Sachit Abraham, consultant in dermatology and cosmetology, practicing in Bangalore at Cosmodoma Care in Koromangla. So the melanin is actually produced by the melanocytes in the skin. Now, this question has two parts, two aspects to it. One is in a normal person. If a normal light skin person wants to increase melanin secretion, then he has to tan himself. That means he has to expose to ultraviolet light, meaning like sunbathing and tanning uh, creams can increase the melanin secretion inside the skin. So this is mainly in a normal person. Then there are some conditions where the melanin secretion is destroyed because there is an autoimmune reaction against the melanocytes. The melanocytes are totally lost in the skin. So th this, is, this is a disease called as vitiligo or uh, leucoderma. Now, to increase the melanin secretion in a person with uh, vitiligo or leucoderma, many different treatments are available. First level is the creams. In this we use creams like steroid creams or non-steroidal creams like tacrolimus are used to stimulate the melanin secretion. The next level, level 2, we come to tablets. Sometimes if the, if the vitiligo is very unstable and rapidly progressing, then we have to give a short course of oral steroids or some other immunosuppressants to stop the we have white patches from spreading all over the body and the level 3 if the dreams and the tablets are not working then if the vitiligo is stable then we can do a treatment called as phototherapy that is exposing to a special uv light called narrow band uvb 311 narrow band uvb light where the person enters into a chamber which has lights with um, special wavelengths of 311 nanometer and the person exposes to this light one twice a week or thrice a week which stimulates the melanin secretion inside the skin. Then there's a latest treatment also called as targeted phototherapy where we can use targeted beams of ultraviolet light in very localized patches of vitiligo where the whole body is not exposed to an ultraviolet radiation. And certain other newer treatments are available which are coming up called as biologics which is in an experimental stage. A biologic called as tofastinib has shown quite a great promise to increase melanin secretion inside the skin.